Fall is my favorite time of the year. And one of the things that I love to do is walk in the flats. I clam a lot. On the other side of the dune where um, I go clamming, there's the uh, marshland. You can look beyond the sand dunes and see the Atlantic. So you get these wonderful, huge views. And Salt Haven is another painting that I did in the fall. The marsh grass goes from verdant green to uh, a lavender color, and then it goes to alizarin crimson, a scarlet red. And as the days go by, you see this, this change in the color of the grasses, see lavenders blooming, and then there's the wildlife. One day I was walking and this snowy owl came up behind me and I saw this big shadow coming over me and I got a little scared there. And there he was, he just went right over my head. So how could I not be inspired by the things that I see here, the things I remember as a kid when I was with my dad and my mom? That's what I get excited about. My mom and dad had sent me to dance lessons and uh, the dance teacher told my parents that I think Elizabeth's talent is in, not in her feet, it's in her hands. I decided I wanted to be an artist. My mother and my father continued to encourage me and I was very fortunate because I told them at an early age, I want to be an artist and they encouraged that. The thing that I think about most about Thanksgiving is being grateful. I feel like I'm a very lucky person to be able to be doing the thing that I love the most, uh, that I can share this with anyone who sees my work, that I can pass this love of art on to my children and my grandchildren. And this is going to be really important this year. This is an important Thanksgiving because of what Amika is doing with one of my pieces of artwork. People who have seen my art, if I ask them why they like my art, they'll say, well, that reminds me of, where a, pl of a place I used to be sometime. And I don't think they're always talking about a specific location because my paintings aren't about a specific location. They're more about a feeling. And Salt Haven would be a place I'd love to spend Thanksgiving in. There's a little house in there. That I, when I put those houses in there, I think of, I'm always thinking of a family or a person, and it's shelter. It's a place that shelters from the storm. What a great place that would be to be on Thanksgiving Day.